first day of our first morning of our camping trip and uh, it's uh, a balmy five degrees Celsius well we'll see what kind of adventures today has to offer it's gonna do a pan of our campsite here and uh, there'll be more scenery and more hopefully wildlife today and a little bit later on but it's like 8 o'clock in the morning and we are just getting ourselves ready to go out and do a little bit of hiking okay be talking to you soon So what brought us into this area was all these, they're all old, but there are lots of tree snaps in here. Nothing fresh, probably snow, but uh, it was kind of curious that all these trees were laying over. Anyways, we're continuing on. So here we are at uh, Etherin Creek area and uh, we're just walking down the trail and we saw some tree snaps and uh, to me I think that was just all snow load snapping those trees off but uh, I walk a little bit further off the trail and just in the bush or not far from the campground and we came across something that's that's uh, a little bit curious. I have Fred here with me today and uh, both he and I we're the amateur squatchers, I guess you could say. We're just getting started in this, but uh, I'm gonna just, uh, point the camera here at Fred and let have him explain what he thinks about this. But uh, I think this this is uh, a possible structure, but I'm not 100% convinced. But uh, here we go. I'm gonna turn the camera over to point it towards Fred and let you let him explain what he thinks it's all about. Yeah, so we're kind of standing underneath um, a bunch of tree snaps. It's almost in the shape of an igloo. Um, what do we notice here too is that there's a path going through here, some sort of game trail. Um, with the branches and stuff, just the way they're interlocked here, to me, doesn't really seem natural. There's a couple spots here. Um, and on this side also, these three trees are kind of interlocked with each other, and if they just fell, I'm not sure if it would be that natural, especially the one that's coming up here. The, the, where the trunk is, there's no stump where it came off of. It's just sitting there. Um, and there's no snaps above us either where it could have come from. And just the way it's interlocked with the other tree, uh, yeah, I don't know. It could be natural, but... So it's what you're inter intricate. You're almost six foot tall, right? Yeah. It's it's up it's above that, right? Oh, yeah. Well yeah. above six feet on the top of the structure. Yeah, this is uh this is curious. Yeah. Just the way they're interlocked together, it's doesn't look natural to me. Here's another look at the stump on the ground of this same structure that we were just looking at. It's just a bit of a wide angle here. Come over this way a little bit. Then. And you can see that it's it's quite intertwined. And some of it does look placed. Whether it's I can't see humans doing this, but um yeah, you can see you have a better look there. It's almost like a little igloo kind of thing, right? Yeah, it's a little dome structure, quite dome much structure, like an yeah. igloo. But you can see all the intricacy there, how it's all woven together. 
So this particular piece here, we've noticed, we're pretty sure it's been placed. There's no stump. It goes up. It's just laying up against there, the rest of it. Pick that up, Fred, and just show that it's loose. Yeah, see, it's no stump. Okay, more and more to find here. Just want to stop here for a second and capture a view of nature's awesome power. So there's a creek 200 meters or so away, but uh, I'd say it breached its banks possibly five years ago and uh, made this mess this isn't uh, this is water this is not man anyways just an interesting little part of our trip here today so this place did have a fire a few years ago so there's a bit of stuff on the ground but interesting well we're going to continue on and see what else we can find of interest talk to you in a little while Couple of little fish in the creek. I'm thinking they're probably trout. I don't know if this one, other one here, is going to pick up. But... Nice. 